Welcome back. Nearly 25 years after the Crown Heights riots and those who lost their loved ones are reuniting. News 12 Brooklyn reporter Emily Lorsch is in Midwood where Norman Rosenbaum, who lost his brother, and Carmel Cateau, who lost his son, are gathering. Emily, what's the significance of this? They're here at a deli on Coney Island Avenue, providing one another friendship, support, and even some laughter. Looking back nearly 25 years, Norman Rosenbaum says he remembers vividly that phone call he received in Australia, letting him know his brother Yankel was brutally stabbed. That was during the Crown Heights riots in the summer of 1991, after seven-year-old Gavin Cato was struck and killed by a Hasidic driver who lost control of his vehicle. The deadly accident triggered three days of violence, hate, and division between the neighborhood's black and Jewish communities. And now Rosenbaum is back in the States to see his longtime friend Cato's father, Carmel. They're having lunch together for the third time since the tragedy. We have a a solid, productive bond, and we want people to understand and appreciate that out of a tragic situation 25 years ago, good things can come. The two men say they wish they can get together more often. Unfortunately, the distance between them doesn't allow for that, but they keep in touch regularly. Reporting from Midwood, Emily Lorsch, News 12 Brooklyn.